The nation's oldest Benedictine convent happens to be located in our area, but after decades of service, the members there have decided to close the doors. Devin Clark took a trip to the St. Joseph Monastery in St. Mary's, and he's live with more on this. Devin? Well, Jen, the convent at St. Joseph Monastery has a legacy that spans over 160 years. But today, they only have 17 members, and now they made the tough decision to close their doors. It started as a vision that manifested in 1852. Three German nuns who settled in St. Mary's began faith-based programs and taught in schools in and around St. Mary's. Today, more than 160 years later, 17 nuns, the oldest being 91 years old, are carrying on that legacy, servicing the community through workshops in and around St. Mary's. But convent administrator Sister Rita Brink says a number of factors, including aging members and declining membership, have made it impossible to stay open and at a meeting Monday they all decided it would be best to close the doors. The decision to work toward closure has been made but there are still a lot of unanswered questions that need to be dealt with and processed uh, one of which is what will become of these buildings and this this space. Now before the convent closes for good each of the 17 nuns must find a new convent to live in and that process can take several years. Reporting live, Devin Clark, 6 News.